Hello and welcome to Journey with Data. So today we will be talking about something interesting that has been in the headlines in the AI community. Yes, you heard it right. It's GPT-4. So GPT-4 or a generative pre-trained transformer is the newest addition to the AI family developed by OpenAI. And if you thought GPT-3 and 3.5 were impressive, wait and watch out this video till the end until you hear what GPT-4 is capable of. Imagine an AI system which knows your preferences and has an eye for detail and also can provide reasoning and perform complex tasks. So this is what this kind of intelligence is exactly what GPT-4 is capable of. And the best part? It is going to be better than before. Now, when did GPT-4 release? GPT-4 was released on uh, 14th March 2023, and it is available via ChatGPT Plus and an API. So for API, you have to join a waitlist and through ChatGPT Plus, you have to uh, apply and you have to purchase a subscription, of course, with a usage cap. So Duolingo, Stripe, Khan Academy, Government of Iceland are some examples that are already leveraging GPT-4. It is also interesting to note how Government of Iceland uses GPT-4 to preserve its language. But for now, let's focus on the excitement that GPT-4 brings to the table. So let's get started. So one area where GPT-4 can be used is in the field of content creation. This beast is an absolute game changer with its ability to handle complex text with ease. And guess what? You can tap into its creative power to write novels, brilliant screenplays, heart-wrenching songs, and even adapt to a user's writing style. But it doesn't stop here. OpenAI, in fact, has promised that GPT-4 can take a wide range of tasks, including the ones we've never imagined. So get ready to be wowed and feel free to try this feature and see how it turns for you. GPT-4 is capable of handling over 25,000 words of text, which is way more than its predecessors. And this allows for enhanced use cases like extended conversations, document search and analysis. In fact, people are also using it to fix up their CVs and also to learn a new language. What's really impressive is even those without a coding background can utilize this tool. For example, to create Chrome extensions, building websites, just from simple sketches. And this is truly amazing. So if you are in need of some coding assistant, GPT-4 is a total no-brainer. This cutting edge model is taking things to the next level by not only accepting text inputs, but also images. That's right. GPT-4 is a multimodal model and it's unlike anything we've seen before. Imagine being able to input an image into GPT-4 and receiving a detailed textual output that's actually describing what's in the image, maybe about finding something funny in the image or maybe about explaining the image component by component. The possibilities are endless. So GPT-4 with this feature while it is still under testing with Be My Eyes, I think it's a huge leap forward in the field of natural language processing. So GPT-4 is a total game changer and we can't wait to see what's in there for this incredible model. But GPT-4 is not just a run-of-the-mill language model. It's power-packed with awesomeness, but one must know how to use it responsibly. Imagine feeding a prompt like a find a medicine that contains these compounds and suggesting some suppliers. So GPT-4 is also finding its usage in the field of medicine discovery. While we've only scratched the surface of this magnificent tool, who knows what new and exciting applications might appear in the years to come. But one thing for sure, GPT-4 is definitely worth keeping an eye on and the future looks bright. So thank you for tuning in and until next time, keep exploring this cutting edge technology and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Journey with Data. Thank you so much.